Most people would face their greatest fear if they were paid enough money. True or false? I would, because my greatest fear is having no money. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot argue with that. <laughs> What's your greatest fear, Stacey? I'm scared of quite a lot of things, most things, in fact. Because you were on I'm a Celebrity, weren't you? Yeah, yeah, that was scary. What, what was the worst <laughs> thing you had to do? Um, I hated that truck thing they put me in, where, like, <laughs> every cubby hole had a different, like, bug in it, and you have to, like, open them up and then untie knots. I mean, and you'd think they'd put the knots a little bit loose for you, you know? <laughs> You've already <laughs> opened this cupboard. <laughs> Some spider cockroach thingy has fallen on you. <laughs> so I was covering bugs, and I was just like, I can't open the knots. <laughs> Why? <laughs> and then it, like, tipped over, chucked me out the back. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy's trying to follow. The story's going. <laughs> I'd love you to explain the plot to a film like Usual Suspects. That'd be great. <laughs> okay, what, what's your great fear, John? What are you? I don't, I'm quite. I'm scared of spiders. I'm scared of heights. I'm scared. I'm scared of things that will. I don't understand why people are supposed to get over their fears. Fear is a legitimate thing to stop you dying of things. <laughs> we used to do a thing at school where you go up to someone and you go, oh, "I've got something for you." Oh, blinky powder. Oh, you blinked. You go, yeah, I thought you were going to throw something in my face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to get over it so that I can end up... But King Harold wasn't in a field going, yeah, didn't blink now, did I? <laughs> <laughs> oh. You make a point and it's not... It, you know, you should be properly scared of things that are dangerous. And you know that guy who had a pet cobra? Oh, yeah, yeah, this was recently. Yeah, he kept a cobra in his house and, um, you know, he kept it for a couple of years and then sooner or later it just <laughs> went like that, bit him and he died. It was very sad. But he was quoted as saying that, that, that cobras are, are much misunderstood. <laughs> I thought, yeah, by you. <laughs> my, um, my friend uh, worked for a while in the lion enclosure in Melbourne Zoo in Australia, and uh, they've had se several people, three people have tried to break in uh, to the, talk to the lions in the middle of the night, mostly... <laughs> Uh, there's a religious man who's, who's jumped in twice and he reads the Bible to them. But the, the other guy was a, a karate, he was a black belt. And when they, the next morning, all they found was his head. And they had a, there was a legal case afterwards to try and find out what had happened. And his sensei was called in. And the quote from his sensei was, no, 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 no. All I said to him was, you are so good, you could fight a lion. <laughs> <laughs> I love the way you say they, they had an inquest. Was it an inquest? Inquest. Inquest into the death. I'm not, I mean, I'm not qualified in any way, but I could tell you what happened there. <laughs> lion go yum yum. <laughs> do, you think, do you think the lion toyed with them at all? Said, what, oh, whoa, that's hard, were you? <laughs> oh, you're a tough guy. What is this? Karate, is it? Never heard of that. <laughs> oh, stop. Ow, that hurts. I just. <laughs> OK, most people would face their greatest fear if they were paid enough money, true or false. Sean? What do you think? Definitely. Yes, OK, yeah, yes, I think definitely. Would. We'll say right. definitely. You're saying, you're saying true, you're saying...? We think yes as well. Yeah. Go on. OK, I can tell you the answer is true. 83% of people would face their greatest fear if they were paid enough money.